Uh, but our forecast, not tropical in any nature today. We have lower humidity values. We've got cooler temperatures and a lot of sunshine for the next two days. That's today and tomorrow. We will have some storms, though, to end the week. So while we do have some dry weather next few days, Friday could be a wet one. We're going to be turning up the heat this weekend. We're in the 70s now, but going up into the 90 degree range by early next week. Radar picture right now is dry. Uh, there's nothing on there that we need to think about or need an umbrella for at all today. Great news there. Here's a look at your dew points. Okay, you may be saying, Megan, I have no idea what a dew point is. Let me tell you, we're in the low to mid 50s for dew points right now. Let's put up your handy dandy guide here. If temperatures, dew point temperatures are between 50 and 55 degrees, it's anywhere from invigorating to pleasant. That's that really comfortable sort of light feel to the day. Nothing impressive about it at all. So beautiful weather expected on this Wednesday. Let's step through it. I have temperatures by noontime at about 75 degrees. Lots of sunshine. North northwesterly wind at around 12 by 5 p.m. We're at 76. Still sunny. Still beautiful. A little breezy, but hardly even any clouds in the sky. Going through the overnight, we may clear out even more for nice clear skies, which may lead to some chilly temperatures tomorrow morning, or at least chilly compared to where we have been down into the 50s. And we expect to find highs getting up into the 70s again all the way through the end of the work week. Friday, we've got a good rain chance out there. But by the weekend, not only does the sun return, but also some of that heat. Temperature wise, we'll get back up to around 90 degrees on Sunday and stay in that vein into next week, Dee.